published, 802 EDT, the 9th of April 2018, updated, 820 EDT, the 9th of April 2018 Mothercare is set to close a third of its 143 stores spread throughout the UK in a desperate bid to survive on the high street, according to a new report. The struggling chain is trying to turn around its fortunes by entering a company voluntary arrangement, CVA, which would allow it to repay debts. This would lead to Mothercare shuttering nearly 50 loss-making locations or slashing rents. Mothercare is set to close a third of its 143 stores spread throughout the UK in a desperate bid to survive on the high street. The store closures was first reported by the Sunday Times. Mothercare has been working to slim down the total number of UK stores to between 80 and 100 from 143, having shuttered several locations over the past year as part of those plans. The chain is bleeding money as debts have risen from £38 million to around £50 million under fired boss Mark Newton Jones. The former chief executive was ousted last week because the board thought his transformation strategy was taking too long to bear fruit, as the company struggles. Sainsbury's, which is the second biggest supermarket in the UK, is said to have been weighing up a bid for the children's wear chain in recent months. Mothercare is also working with its lenders as it seeks waivers of certain financial governance, it was reported last month. The company, which only issued a profit warning in January following dismal Christmas trading, said it expects adjusted pre-tax profit to come in at the lower end of the £1 million to £5 million range it had previously guided. Mr Newton Jones was replaced by former Tesco man David Wood. The appointment of Mr. Wood comes at a difficult time for the baby retailer, which recently appointed KPMG to advise on a refinancing of the firm. The group called in the accountancy giant to help it secure waivers to its financial covenants as it looks at additional sources of financing from its lenders HSBC and Barclays. The group has been hammered on the stock market after warning over profits twice since the start of the year and revealing that talks with its banks were underway.